In this video, we're going to talk about working with files in Komodo Edit. So first of all, we're going to discuss how to use and navigate tabs, some useful tips there. Next, we're going to talk about how to preview files in the embedded Komodo browser. Next, we're going to associate file extensions with syntax highlighting. If you don't know what either of those things are, no problem, I'll, I'll explain those. And finally, we're going to look at some different display options, such as how to use word wrap, how to view white space, and indentation guides. Okay, let's get started. Let's go ahead and start by exploring how we can use tabs in the editor pane in Komodo Edit. So as you may remember from previous videos, the editor pane is a section over here. It's the biggest part of Komodo Edit, and it's where we'll do our editing of files. The tab section shows up at the top right here. And the other item that we want to pay attention to during this lesson is the view item in the topmost menu. So um, there's some options there for viewing our files in particular ways, and we'll get to those in just a bit. So let's take a look at what we can do with tabs. First of all, I've opened up a bunch of files, and each file corresponds to a single tab. So if I click tabs, you can see that this is jumping between different, different types of files. The start page that you see is also a tab, and you can close this by clicking a little X there. Now it's gone. Now we have a little bit more space in our tab region. So what happens when we open up enough files that there's no more room up here? Let's go ahead and see what happens. I'm going to double click to open a bunch of files. And you can see that some arrows show up on either side of the tab listing. So I can click these to jump, uh, to jump one file for each click all the way over to each side. Now this isn't the only way I can navigate through. I can also click this button right here. And this shows all of the tabs that are open right now. And I can jump to different ones just by clicking them. One other way I can get to another tab is by clicking on Window, and I see all of my items here listed as well. Now if I have multiple windows open, this should show up, uh, those different windows should show up in this listing as well. Right now we only have one. Let's say we want to reorder our tabs so we have the most important files that we're working on to the very far left of our tab listing. Let's say that's node, node.tpl.php, and user.module. All we need to do is go ahead and drag these over, and you can see that little blue marker showing up behind the tab, the ghost tab, and that will show us where we're going to drop it. So if we drop it, we see that it shows up on the very far left, and I can move this over here to the right of node.tpl.php, and there we go. We've moved them around. 